save it using control s and now refresh the page see SL in which we have to give the percentage and H is for the angle which you want. It is of 0 degree so it is of red type. You can even inspect it. What you have to do is just select over here, select it and you can see this color. Now clicking on this, this is the HSLA value, you can see HSLA value, you can up or down this. This is the hex value for that, this is the RGBA value for that. This is the HSLA value for that and this is the hex value. So seeing the HSLA value, A is for occupancy, if we by default it is taking 1, but we can convert it to any other value. Suppose here 0% is not, we have to write something, 34%. So this is the HSLA value. From here you can change the occupancy also. From 0 to 1 it takes the value. Suppose you want to be 0 0.5. Then you can write it over here. You can also make changes in the code. Suppose you open the code and here you using HSLA value to give over here to be 0.5 save it using control S cut it over here now refresh the page you can see the occupancy has decreased. If we write it one over here, then you see the occupancy. If we write one, save it using Control S, refresh the page, see the difference. The occupancy has been changed. So we have seen the six methods of giving any giving giving color an element first was using the name second was using the hex value third using the rgb value fourth using the rgba value fifth using the hsla in which h was the angle and sl was percentage and hsla in which a is the occupancy which consists of the value from zero to one so this is all about the color styling using css thank you very much